Hello everybody, my name is Nathan from iSpecs.com and today we're talking about Wayfair Ray-Ban sunglasses. Today I have 10 Ray-Ban Wayfair sunglasses in front of me. On this side is the 2140 original Ray-Ban Wayfair sunglasses and on this side is the 2132 new Ray-Ban Wayfair sunglasses. Okay, so the original 2140, I mean, it's a classic. It's like a Ford Mustang. It doesn't go out of style. It's just, it, it's beautiful. They've been around for like what? 50 plus years, basically, as long as sunglasses have been around. I'm pretty sure I've even seen photos of the dinosaurs back in the day wearing these sunglasses. I mean, who wouldn't? They're just, they're classics, you know? Now, although these sounds basically perfect, there was one downfall with these. And it's, you see the lens shape right here? It's kind of curving in and you think of it when you wear sunglasses I mean it protects your eyes from the Sun but the Sun is on top and when a lens shape is curving in like this Sun's going right into your eyes and it has like a tilt and it, it just doesn't really make sense but at the end of the day I mean they still look sick now both the 2140s and the 2132s come in both polarized or non-polarized glass lenses and both glasses are also unisex so if you're out with your girl and she sees these on you I mean, she could just take them off and put them on herself. Fun little fact, Ray-Ban actually uses codes for the lenses. G15 is for the green glass lenses, and B15 is for the, well, brown glass lenses. Kind of makes sense. Now, Ray-Ban did release a model basically fighting the whole non-tilt situation thing, and here's where the 2132s come in. Now, as you can see, these glasses, I mean, it's its perfectly straight. It will protect your eyes from the sun. You won't have that issue of, you know, sun coming in your eyes. But there is one thing about these glasses, and you can tell, I mean, they're clearly smaller. You still get the classic American having hot dog, watching baseball game, feeling all your celebrities wearing these glasses, like Tom Cruise, Marilyn Monroe even, uh, MJ, King of Pop, even the other MJ, Michael Jordan, the GOAT. I mean, they're all wearing this. Doesn't matter if it's the 2132s or the 2140s. These are just classic glasses. So if you want the classic Ray-Ban look, but in a smaller size, go for the 2132s. But if you want the original Wayfair sunglasses, I mean, the 2140s, they're classic. They really are. And these are also better for people with bigger head shapes. And personally, I'm a 2140 guy. Now let's go over the actual sizes. On the original 2140 Wayfarers, you have the 54 eye size. The width of the lens is going to be 54 millimeters. The distance between the lenses or the bridge is 18 millimeters. And the temple length is 150 millimeters. Now on the 2132 Wayfarers, you have the 52 eye size. The width of the lens is going to be 52 millimeters. The distance between the lenses or the bridge is 18 millimeters. And the temple size is 145 millimeters. So basically one has a bigger lens and the other one doesn't. Me personally, if I had to choose, I'm going with the classic black 2140 Ray-Ban wafers. These, th when you wear this, it feels like America. Thank you for watching, and if you're interested in checking out either the 2140s or the 2132s, you can head over to iSpecs.com and check them out, or call one of our many customer service representatives. They'll be glad to help you. You can call at 1-833-ISPECS. Again, that's 1-833-ISPECS. They're really, they're, they're both classic and you just can't go wrong with either one that you pick. I'm gonna go get a hot dog now. See you guys.